option. All right, so this game is Nublex against Fly against Sienz against Fire Dragon apparently. Yep. Played uh, on Silver Pine Forest. So um, just give me a minute to see when it was played. I don't know. Apparently, it was played some sometime in two thousand. Uh, oh. two thousand eight, probably. September the thir thirteen September thirteen, two thousand eight. This game between uh Nublex Yane um Fly and uh Yes, I'm using Explit uh on the one of the few guys who like Explit better and I like to stream full screen at actually also uh, I have a bug when I am in Windows mode on Warfare Arena, uh, so it's fucking annoying. Anyway, so this game is from 2008. Uh, balance position on uh, on Silver Pine, so you have uh, three Night Elf and one Undead. Uh, these guys are very well known, so if you don't know them, let me present them. Fire Dragon is probably the the three of us are really top class. Uh, Fire Dragon is a very good player but probably not as strong as them. He's still playing at the, uh, nowadays. He's always playing Night Elf. I think he plays Orc as well but uh, he's a good player but I wouldn't have many special things to say about him. Fly uh, wants a free fall Master League season 4. Uh, he plays all races. He was uh, he was he had a, a big fan base when he was playing. He was probably one of the best who ever played. Nublex, uh, he w he participated in the first season one uh, FF Master final. He was uh, legendary as well for his play with Night Elf. Uh, he's uh, the best macro player, which which existed at that time and uh, Yane uh, who were in a uh, FML final in uh, season 7 or 8 or 8 I'm not sure plays undead uh, he, made, he made a comeback a uh, few months ago after a lot of years of uh, an activity and now he, he won the play FFA ladder season number 3 so he's doing very well at the moment he's playing undead so this game is it's not supposed to be very long, which makes me think that um, Nublex uh, did not win it because uh, usually Nublex uh, means long games. So his uh, Ancient of War, uh, about to Ancient of War creep is a uh, ogre camp there. Uh, we should see a lot of her uh, units actually, <laughs> obviously in that game with. Uh, so many night elf in a hundred. So position uh, on silver pine. Uh, even though many players usually like to fight their neighbor in w when they are balanced position like that, I would myself uh, prefer to fight the guy at the other side of my uh, expansion because uh, everyone gets uh, a natural expansion and there there is uh, two slots open in in between two players. And I think you should consider fighting the guy who is going to compete with you for those mines instead of fighting the guy next to you just because he's next to you. Uh, what time for me? Uh, for me, it's uh, what time is it? I have no idea. <laughs> it's nearly midnight. Uh, I'm in Florida. Yeah, Yen was playing free fall even before that. Uh, but uh, one day I will stream is the FML final he played. Uh, he lost uh, being 
teamed three versus one and he was very 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 upset and he just slams the door and said I will not play anymore and he actually did not play <laughs> anymore FFA game after that up until uh, now so yeah he was very upset after that game um, maybe once I will shortcast uh, F FML final I made videos uh, out of the first two and um, I could shortcast uh, some others but they are usually very long so I don't know if you guys want me to shortcast long replays maybe if I accelerate some parts of her dragon going uh, emula emulation first I have uh, I have opened a topic on the website about uh, all strategies we don't see anymore uh, this is one of them going emulation with Demon Hunter now I feel like everybody is playing the same way uh, doing the same thing all the time which is a little sad because there are so many strategies that could work uh, to mix things up see uh, Noblex going Panda first <laughs> sorry you don't see much player going Panda first anymore I think uh, maybe Doveki now but No, uh, I'm European because I'm French, but I'm not in Europe at the moment. Uh, is there a good FFL replay that isn't that long? Uh, yeah, there are a lot of good. Uh, there are a lot of good FFL replay uh, which are not long, but usually uh, the epicness of uh, of refall it really uh, it really shows off in a longer games because these are games that uh, you end up with uh, two players fighting until the legs building or until the, the last heroes and heroes are going to be trip 10 and when you have trip 10 hero fight it's kind of amazing s amazing situation so um, about fights you can have good fights in a in many FFA game I streamed a lot of good fight especially in my last youtube video uh, with uh with lost tensions which was the best night of players i think ever in in free fall uh, it's on my youtube channel play tv you can watch the last uh posted uh, video if you like night elf uh, and you want to see a good night of player fighting in free fall you, you can see him he's crushing everybody but it was a uh, very high class. Yes, there was a lot of quick intense battle. Which he was always winning, but playing uh, with Warden, Dark Ranger and Panda. And what is good with Lost Ancient is in, in that game I uh, I, I shortcasted and posted. He plays a very smart game. He's, he's adapting to all situation. His uh, his last opponent is trying uh, to mix things up and uh, change armies, and he's using good counters with all all the possible uh, units that. Uh, Neither can you, so he's not just making cameras and he pulls like we s often see. He's really mixing things up and uh, he's really making the situation hopeless for his opponent. Like, at this time, you think he has a good idea, uh, Lost Tension has a better one. Alright, so early on, uh, everybody is doing some creeping, uh, and another thing we don't see anymore is uh, uh, that going Dreadlord first with a uh, sleep and aura everybody seems to go death knight leash uh, dreadlord all the time sometime with a dark ranger third but so fly uh, is fighting no blacks like i expected that it should happen nice buff four archer died at the same time Nice proof of fire from uh, from Dublex. <laughs> Lol. <laughs> Those two guys are very good friends, uh, Noblex and uh, Fly. 
it's it was a it still is but it was a very good community with a uh, lot of friendships we will leave miss those guys there and Yane uh, with against fire dragon so he's slipping him and trying us around is he going to be able to yeah he did not expect him to have immolation i believe still uh, staying around him and tp now so he's going to oh nice nice he, he killed his uh, own uh, goal before yeah. Fire Dragon got the experience, but I don't know if it was very useful to make him TP losing uh, everything but one gold. So Fly uh, level 3 and 1, Nublex uh, doing very good creeping, al already level 4 Panda, and it's going to take as a first uh, red camp in the middle. Um, yeah, it's 7-8 uh, minutes into the game, and uh, you really want to take those damn uh, SAAP. This game is going to be fast actually, it's a, uh, it's uh, f something like 30 minute game, so it's not going to be very, l very long. Yeah, yeah, yeah you train, this game is Yane, uh, Nublex, Fly and um, Fire Dragon, so yeah, good players. But an old game. So Yen is probably taking to to Gargs. Uh, he has his Death Knight up, making a slaughterhouse. Very nice way to build his expansion so he doesn't get attacked. Uh, very nice position building. Very very hard to reach for Zacharite. So he he went. Priestess of the Moon second, no blacks. And he may he may lose it's a panda is trying to to block it but oh that that's buff. Oh my god, why is it's not why are you not he just said what the fuck? He has probably problem with his keyboard or something. So we are both fighting to get this uh, in between uh, expansion slot because whoever is going to get it is going to be very strong because it's going to be two mine against one. So on silver pine uh, with those position, you really want to fight and not let uh, the other guy get it. Nowadays, people they just say, "Okay, t I take the top, you take the bottom, and uh, that's boring." Uh, those days, uh, you just fight for it, which is. Uh, more interesting and fire dragon going uh, immolation first on his uh, demon hunter and on keeper of the grove he went uh, treants so he manages to to save his uh, expansion so far he has a shade on his ass but now the gargs are coming and he has a couple of archers so Let's see what happens there. Uh, Nublex and uh, and Fly are suffering each other, but Fly is getting the advantage at the moment. He has a staff. He has no staff. Is he going to be able? Ah, he has a staff on uh, his Priestess of the Moon. Yep. It's not going well for, for Nublex after this uh, weird uh, hero loss before. He's losing uh, ground against Fly. So very similar situation. They both try to to fight for the middle expansion, and Nafar Dragon going to cruise the, the red can there, and he's going to be hit from behind by uh, by Yane. He manages to kill the big ogre. I don't know which item he got. Uh, the orb of uh, darkness. Yeah, there are better better items to get. So level 4 and 2 for Yen. Fly took down the expansion of Nublex and right away he goes creeping to try to get level 3 on his panda. He 
No Black's going Fairy Dragons and uh, Chimeras against uh, against Fly uh, Ground Army so far, but I don't think he's going to stay with this. Making Chimeras as well. And there's a fight between Fairy Dragon and Yain. Yeah, Fire Dragon did not really produce anything uh, at all to uh, to sustain his uh, claim to this uh, gold mine, so he did not he did not get any any, any gold yet from it. Nice surround with Garks, surrounded the Demon Hunter with a uh, stone form, and uh, he was forced to staff it back. So he has two heroes blocking his uh, expansion with a uh, with a TP. And the Demon Hunter is far away now, on the other side. Only now he's making camera rules, so he's a little late, Fire Dragon on his tech. And he has a... Uh, I never know, whatever arrow, Fire Arrow. On his uh, Priest of the Moon, so... Have you ever FFL before? That's why Fire Dragon says uh, when he's losing. Fly is doing a very uh, excellent creeping. My bet is uh, on him winning, which is all usually uh, always a safe bet since he is one of the best who ever played. And his Night Elf was uh, very strong. All his races were tr strong, but Night Elf and Undead really his strongest. Uh, So with creeping this, uh, Nublex is going to be able to catch up a little bit with uh, with the experience. Uh, nice nuke, and we miss the nuke, but he, he managed to kill the keeper of the grove, but he lost his leech at the same time. Not sure how. And that's the attack on the natural of Nublex, so he, try he needs to try to save it because... Uh, yeah, but he's not going to be able to do it. He's not using TP. He'd rather bring the fight to fly. Because now, uh, no expansion for Nublex, so he needs to, to have fly without an expansion as well. Fly is taking one in the bottom there, unscouted by uh, Nublex. Fly is not uh, biting his uh, opponent bait. He's not going to, to defend so far. No, it's Noblex who, st who starts in uh, TP. Yeah, because he, he was going to be food block if he was losing any more moon well. So, um, yes, Yen, Yen scouted the, the expansion, but I don't think Noblex, Noblex is aware that Fly is expanding in the bottom. So now that uh, Fire Dragon as a Real army is going to be able to defend this expansion better, but Yen is taking the top one, so Yen is fine. He has three expansion, uh, two expansion, Fair Dragon, two expansion, and Fly and Nublex are a little down on uh, on that point. Nublex is uh, is attacking, uh, is being attacked by Fly. More more hippo uh, hippogriff for for Nublex. So he's going to be able to really crush uh, the army of Fly. Wo Choose not to not TP till taking right side gray piece is not is not really doing that. <laughs> <laughs> he's trying to to kick those uh, talents. He, he can kill the these chimeras maybe instead. Yeah, yeah, kill it. Wow, he decided not to not to kill that. Uh, he didn't pay attention. This uh, ninety six elf points. And Yen is somewhat asking a piece on Fire Dragon. I don't think he should piece Fire Dragon. I think he should kill him. Yen, what are you doing, Yen? Oh, Yen is watching the shortcast, actually. <laughs> hey, Yen, it's yourself. It's you in purple, Yen. Maybe someone tell him he's never putting the sound on. 
I'm gonna tell him. Yeah, he says your game from 2008. Okay. Ah yes, I see. Ah, yeah, he's, he's with sound. I thought you you did not have the sound. Yes. Yeah, so why is he pissing fire dragon since silver two are killing each other so much, uh, ruining each other economy? Uh, nobody is taking the right side. Uh, you should not kick Nublex expansion actually, but you are doing it. Yep. Uh, ba bad idea. Bad idea. He was doing fine against Fire Dragon. Uh, Fire Dragon is still uh, still in a strong position. With uh, he managed to save his expansion. Fucking Yain, sorry. Ah, he says sorry, so he knows it's bad. But even if it's still, it's bad. Uh, Till has no expansion now. Fly is uh, really struggling against uh, against Nublex. I don't know. Yeah, Till does not have a right side. Ray, I was wrong. I think Ray does not give a shit, he, he just wants to kill Yain, but um, since he had a little break, he could uh, organize his, uh, his army better, uh, take a little bit, and he's going to attack Yain, most likely. And now, Yain seemed like he wanted to attack Nublex again, or he was just going to the shop, I'm not sure what he's doing. I don't know why he paused uh, his fight against, uh, against Fire Dragon. Fly does not care at all, just going at Nublex and Nublex going at Fly. Maybe not, but they did get all the creeps. Yeah, they did a very good creeping. No idea why I asked for peace. Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know why you come and uh, involve, involve in, in their fight neither. Uh, because what you might do, y y you might get them to peace. And I think you will get them to peace in a in in one minute, and you don't want them both uh, on your on your back. Want to control your uh, one v one fair check? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's it's like a guy saying, "Yeah, is you want to control your kid." What the fuck was I doing? Gonna get three v one. Yeah, I think so. Fire Dragon never said he was. Uh <laughs> he was letting you go, and uh, you just attack the other two. So <laughs> I think Yen is going to have uh, some enemies. And now is he going to engage three people in five minutes? Ah, not yet. Yeah, he should have kicked this expansion Yen and uh, try to progress on Fire Dragon main. But they really want to to kill each other. F fly and f and no blacks. It's like they don't even pay attention to Rain. There are some rivalry going on between the, those two. But no blacks, surprisingly for me, uh, is winning. Yeah, that's a game for him. I don't think uh, uh, Fly is going to be able to recover from uh, from that. Uh, no blacks. Outsmarted him a lot. Uh, he is down to 50 food uh, uh, fly, while Nublex are 80 food, and Nublex has uh, two trees, two expansion, about to go. Uh, Fire Dragon sort of try to sort of attack uh, Yain, but sort of decided not to. So he's going probably to go on the expansion, or just walk around. Okay. No, not no no free v one for Yain, even though he deserved it. Uh, nowadays, you do that, you get three v one. Old schoolers they were more brutal. Mrs. Silence. 
It's interesting to see how bad uh, Noblex did at start losing his pre-stress. Uh, losing his expansion and, and he managed to to really turn uh, the momentum onto him. So what is uh, Fire Dragon doing is very very good actually. Uh, he knows that Fly is dying. Uh, maybe from chat, maybe from scouting with all. I'm not sure how he really uh, noticed that but he, d he did notice that and uh, he does not want Noblex to get all the experience from him. So since Fly is dying Better to be the one killing him, so he's trying to uh, finish him off. Yeah, that's what everybody should do when uh, someone is dying to someone else. You come, you... Yeah, Fly has left. Oh, he's giving his... Uh, he's giving his... Wow, it's very... Very sore loser on that one. I got a leave for FML. Come on. That's why the game is so <laughs> short. <laughs> I got a little <laughs> FML thing. Sorry. Sorry guys, I tried to stream games uh, I didn't watch before and I did not expect that to happen. So Nublex left for FML. Uh, did he really left for FML or was it going to die? Uh, was he going to die to... Uh, to Yane. Where is uh, Nubek's army? There. He was going to die to Yane. Yeah, he was going to die to Yane. Crap, I wanna watch. Ah, quick battle, fight and go. Apparently there was some big game in, f in, in FML on uh, September 13, 2008 and they wanted all to watch or they just ruin, ruin the ending of the game. You see an observer who just left as well. Walking TRL was a Canadian player. I don't know why Fire Dragon is staying there. They're going to have one big fight and then... Uh, we will see what happens. So Yen may win that because Yen is uh, a way better player than Fire Dragon. So both use a scroll of uh, protection, but yet to uh, stone stone form his Garg. So. And he's fighting in the moon worlds. But still, he's winning the fight. So I don't know why he does that. No hit and run. Fighting in moon worlds with as much food. And he wins. That's called micro, I guess. Yeah. And it's a win for Yen. Yay! Yen won. Yeah, I think it's interesting. You you put good into your army, and I think that uh, uh, since uh, this guy does not have a panda, and since uh, he has no level six yet, it's it's a smart thing to do. Good and guard is pretty standard uh, solo strategy, and it works. And it works well against Night Elf. Yep, so GG. Yen won, but that was a weird game, but Yen won. Uh, pr pretty sure no Blacks uh, will have died to the attack of, the of Yen, but who knows. Okay, so I'm going to try and check and see if any interesting game is starting now. So just give me a minute. And if not, maybe we are going to watch another Yen games from... No, nothing interesting is starting. 
Seems like FedEx fixed his internet though. He has a good ping there, 91. Yeah, no, this game there, Battleground. With some uh, from No Name and the guy play for fun, who so the guy pretending to be hacking. Maybe he is. Uh, okay, so another replay. So let's try and find out if I have uh, another replay from Ian since he's watching the room. The shortcast, he may be able to to help us understand exactly what he thought when he was doing some goofy things. I have a lot of replays. I'm trying to find something not too long and I'm trying to find something against interesting opposition. I have a lot of Yen replays actually from that period. I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 replays. Uh, all the one the one against Rectify and the Muslim. I don't know if it's a good one. Yeah, your play was funny. That's why we are going to watch. You were in Clan I at that time. E Y E. Ah, much long games. Oh, Yen against Lost Ancient. Boom! I want to watch it. Lost Ancient is a. It's really, I think, uh, the best, best, best night of player ever. And see everybody lost against Yane. They, they know they are the best. So Old Nebu is a, is a guy I don't really like since he, he hacked uh, our website long time ago. He's a night of players playing very, all, all very bad, I would say. He always go Demon Hunter, fast take to Repo Riders attacked the guy next to him, uh, kill him or not, and then uh, and then he leaves because he's going to be killed by someone else. He's next to an undead actually, so fate is now a red player, is going to be uh, Hippo Rider rushed by, uh, by Nebu. Uh, Nebu from Great Britain, fate is now, I don't know who is. Uh, this is Lost Tension, who is going to go High Hope Warden. Dark Ranger Panda, and I want you guys to see how deadly it is. And this is Yane. We're going to do something, something goofy, maybe. Go go Epic Solo. Very nice position luck on 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 Yane. I vaguely remember most of this game. Yeah, actually, I vaguely remember the one before. I had a I had a hut hunch that is going to be a. Some crappy ending, and, uh, and yeah, I saw it before. The tension was the other that for me to fight against back then, especially with Valen. Yeah, he is terrific. And since Sweet wanted to see a good, a good, f good fight with a uh, FFA, maybe he can watch that. I would love to to see someone try what he's doing because everybody is doing the same thing now all the time. Like your dreadlord first. Nobody's going dreadlord first anymore. Uh, I saw sexy do it a few months ago on a few games, but all right. So position luck for for Yen. He has uh, one free slot there and two free slot on on his right. Uh, the worst position is for Nebu, who is a uh, one slot away from lost. He's semi surrounded, as we say. And cross position to fade his knob, fade his knob, and um, fade his knob is a uh, okay position, but he's going to be rushed by Nebu, so it's not going to be uh, so good for him. And lost tension, he has two empty slots at his left and right, he's doing good scouting already, uh, and he's always doing that. Uh, he's planning for the future, so he's always doing. Uh, a base with the moon wells uh, at the borders of the entrance of his base, so he's building building the moon wells far away from his uh, from his tree. So the tree is pretty naked at start. He's going to put moon wells there and there and uh, there, and so wherever you come from, uh, you're gonna run, uh, you're gonna fight him in the moon wells. And uh, production building in the back. Uh, 
and some towers is the best ba ba base builder ever or maybe one of the best uh, so your choice of course Nebu goes demon hunter as I said and it's going to to fast tech to hippo riders don't care if lost or Yen wins cause whoever loses should win their next game And Dreadlord first again for Yen, so it was like a trademark at that time for him, going Dreadlord first with a uh, Sleep and uh, Aura. Dreadlord first is a very decent uh, strategy. The only issue with Dreadlord first is to is to fight ear early fights uh, the before you get 50 foot fight. If you get into fights uh, and you have a Dreadlord Ghoul, it's somehow s it's really hard to fight for a guy with regular micro like me. It's way it's way easier to defend from an early attack with a uh, DK and Fins than with the Ghouls and uh, Dreadlord. For example, you have uh, an idol if he can uh, mana burn you once and uh, that's it. <laughs> You cannot sleep anything. Uh, ag against a uh, human, it's hard to fight as well. It's uh, it's very hard to fight early on. It's good to creep, but to fight a little harder. So the warden for lost tension. And uh, ghouls as well for fight his knob. Uh, I vaguely remember him, and he has a very aggressive uh, expo play style since he already has one up, and he has put a second necropolis there to take a second expansion there. So he's trying to uh, he's trying to get as much gold as he can as fast as possible, which is going to probably bite him uh, pretty hard since. I'm pretty sure Nebu is going on his uh, Hippo Riders rush once again. And he's already close to tier 2 while uh, Red is already uh, all still tier 1, sorry. So the Shredder for Yen. Well, sweet, if you have Replay Kit now, uh, what is good? Re replay Kit really saved us. Uh, a lot of trouble uh, since you can now go to fast forward to the end of a game uh, without watching uh, the two first towers like uh, like we used to to have to do before. Uh, so you, you you can fast forward to the end of some games and see uh, epic battles uh, with uh, strong heroes. Th this game will end with epic battle of strong heroes because uh, I think it's. Uh, at least uh, one hour and a half free play. Now we want to see again against Lost Tension. Never, never saw us free play because at that time in 2008 uh, I stopped completely Warcraft 3, FML. Basically, Vorpex stopped and I stopped. At that time I couldn't live without Vorpex. So the league was uh, was led by uh, a guy named Kylin. So Fate is now is doing his aggressive expansion style, finally taking to tier two and uh, engine of wind coming up. Two engine of wind coming up. So yes, uh, pretty much uh, obviously hippo hippo riders for for this guy. Yeah, he was going priestess of the moon uh, second for the aura, of course, and does that end uh, dark ranger second. So yeah, he's going to go his standard warden dark ranger panda and Yain going to go death knight and then leash. He does not have a DK yet. Uh, he prefers to to fast take to tier three and put uh, a two more creeps. Uh, DK coming now. Now 
not going the not getting the kill on the on the wisp. So can defend versus Nebul Rush. We already are start starting to talk about uh, his way to play. Uh, the fact he's rushing all the time. And when you are dead and dead, even though you know it's coming, this uh, this rush with the riders, it's super hard to fight. Very very hard. Lost will beat that rush easy. Yeah, but I don't think he's going to rush Lost. He rushed me once like that. It was very annoying. Before he could finish me, he got killed by someone else, but uh, he killed me as well. So, Yen, do you think you're going to win? I hope you don't remember how it ends. No spoilers. <laughs> so Nebu has his Hippo Riders up. Immolation. So against this, Fins does not work, and uh, Gargs, you don't have enough Gargs to compete early on. Yeah, and Red is uh, really on the. Oh, he's going Panda second. Fate is now. Mm. Is he playing like Proton? And the last red camp. Uh, no, he cannot. He cannot repeat. Red is going to have a hard time to to level his panda, but Nebu's rush is a little late. Uh, already ten minutes into the game, and now uh, Fate is now has three gargs. So if he keeps pumping gargs, now he's going to have six gargs. So he made three creeps. And Nebu is creeping, so Red should be fine. I don't remember this one yet, but I have a bad feeling about the this one. Those observers are talking so much. So, those tension is breaking 50, uh, he's already 55. So, is he going to kill some units or? Yes, K killing units. It's 51 now. Yeah. Lost is 51, I don't know why. Kin maybe he's just finishing this camp and then he's going to take care of this uh, little uh, macro issue. Yes, 50. Still no attack from uh, old Nebu, but uh, he's 80 now. Okay, Nebu is 80. I believe Red is still 50. Yep, still 50 for Red. I know I'm uh, hiding the uh, resources there, but you can see it there. And uh, Yen 50. Everyone is 50 except Nebu, who is going to rush someone. And actually, it's not Red. He's going four. He's going. And he's going to be two to when he attacks. Now he went to the shop. He has scrolls, one egg on the priestess. KTG pretty weak, just a portion. Uh, now he's going right as ex as I expected. 
So let's see the Nibu Rush 12 minutes, 13 minutes into the game. Fate's fate is sealed. So they think fate is going to die. I think so too. Ah, he took the the combo of uh, Proton XX we saw twice already with Panda and Pit Lord. So he has uh, four ziggurats and see how effective they are against this rush. Yeah, Red does not know Nebu actually because he he seems to be surprised. Saying he's going to suicide, but he has not enough gargs, you see. Not enough gargs to fight that. It's uh it's really surprising he did not know because Nebu does not have any other strategy, so all his army is dead already. Uh, don't protect your KOTG, it's fine. Just lol. Yeah, so now he, he needs to put his archer back on his Hipporo, Hippogriff, but... Not sure what Nebu is doing. Not smart to get Riders again. Wait, it was smart when uh, his opponent was not making new gargs, but now while he kick he kicked one crypt, he really need to rebuild those crypts. Oh he has two worms now. Decides to try to force a TP focusing the DH but Yeah it's not going too well for Red even though Nebu is very sloppy. Yeah, it's very sloppy. Using a uh, lightning shield on uh, one archer. And Nebu uh, had a terrible micro uh, as well. Nice buff. So Fate is Nub is... Uh, oh, and the QTG coming back. Hey, he's back. C go back. There. Come on. I know it was six years ago, but I'm still talking to you. Where is the QTG there? Come on. He forgot. <laughs> ah, he forgot his QTG. Good. So that was Nebu in action. Now when you survive his first attack, you usually kill him. So what about loss? Still 50 food, 4,000 gold and yain. 50 food, 7,000 gold. Way to go, Yain. So I never quite understood the, the idea of uh, Pitlord third in this combo. I know it's good against tanks. But uh, he's playing... Uh, under the night elf, so oh, he's on a laptop, that's why. Lost six expense, six expansion says in line one, two, three. No, yes, four. First, some sort of uh, <coughs> attack between Yain and uh, Last Tension. They are going to sort of uh, hero fight at 50 for a little while. Yep, he lost. I don't know why he rebuilt right away. Nice, you need to see this, this Dark Ranger. He tried to focus the Warden, but Warden had a potion. It's 4-2 four, four against 4-3-3. Three, three. And Nebu is back in the main of 
fate is not but is actually winning so I miss uh, misread the situation he kills a uh, death knight he likes to hero focus like that He's, he lost two rooms I don't think he needed two rooms to fight one maybe but we needed Karak there so Panda is surviving buying potions and potion you, he cannot use those potions yeah he, he just used one he cannot use another so he kills the KOTG this is a real slaughter there everybody is dying so Debu is down to nothing again and the pit lord is alone to defend So Nebu has to TP. Uh, Fate is now, but still is uh, free expansion running, even though one has only two acolytes. And Nebu has uh, is expo them to the last attack of uh, Fate is now, so he's going to have a hard time rebuilding now because he's down to 200, 200, uh, 200 gold. the opponent is catching much gold much faster so he should f finally manage to end Nebu so those guys are fighting for green camp I hope they start fighting f with each other quite soon so you can see uh, one entrance with moon world he does not care about this entrance apparently and another entrance with moon world He trying to get a DK, nice sleep, nice silence, everything is nice. That's how I comment game saying nice, nice, nice. He needs boots. Yeah, he, why don't you have boots? This must have been my holding phase. Yeah, you are doing pretty good. You have 15,000 gold after 20 minutes. I lost as only 11,000 gold. Scaling with Druids of the Talon. You can do that. Uh, usually, and either they like to put it very, very fires on Acolytes, for example. And he's doing that. I'm so, so predicting the future of the past. Okay. Well, sometimes sometimes you need boots just to run away. So boots are made for running. This is a song, actually. I'm not going to sing. I'm not drunk. Even though I really want to. So this is... Um, Ah, FedEx following me. Thank you, FedEx. So this is uh, Nebu again trying to finish up red, but uh, hey, you have less gold, less food now. You are going to look very ridiculous to the next fight. Uh, you don't need your panda. You can kill him without panda, I think. Yen is my WTGL partner. Uh, were you playing with uh, Luis? My screen is flickering like mad. Oh yeah, it is. Thank you, Doveki. Let me try to to see what I can do. Yes, yeah, it's, it's going to stop in a second. This flickering. I'm sorry about that. Thank you for. Yeah, I'm streaming full screen, but it does not matter with the X split uh, usually. Uh, in a minute, I'm going to go back to. to my desktop, and uh, usually uh, I just need to. Uh, 
remove the the game from the overlay and go back and that should work better uh, I don't know why it, it went this way I always uh, stream the full screen with a uh, with X split is not an issue you know that should better it, the flickering comes from uh, when uh, when you stream a game uh, from the monitor and not from the game so you, you have to wait yeah now I'm in the game and it's fine all right uh, so of course now uh, Nebu is out goal and out numbered uh, is going to die okay I stop <laughs> it's too late oh more 50 foot fight between uh, those two uh, boring players <laughs> <laughs> okay good piece now why do you piece kill him Okay, it's joking. I love that. Okay, peace. <laughs> Creeping. <laughs> oh, he's a funny dude. Lola. I'm creeping yourself. Wow, it's, it's still amazing that he managed to defend with a panda pit lord. He's going to get some uh, good level from that. Even though gold wise is way below, so Nebu is never leaving until everything is down. He wants to harass you until the end. So he TP'd, uh, he TP'd far away with all his whips he could. He's trying to rebuild somewhere else and annoy, annoy Red. On the gold count, 23,000 for, for Yen with 52. So he broke 50. Maybe he's going to fight now. 14,000 for lost, so huge advantage for, for Yane. And uh, Fate is now with uh, 2,000. So you see how Nebu's uh, lol can triple with 1k. Yeah, uh, Nebu has 1k and is trying to find a place to, to rebuild. So Yane with suicide. Goblins. Ah. Yeah, he took sappers and uh, took them one expansion of lost. And two expansion of lost actually. Apparently used two on uh, on this tree and one on this tree and with his heroes he, he managed to take both of them. So he's taking a decent advantage against Lost. We're still not breaking. Yeah. yeah. No, none of them are working. No, you were 52 because you. You were 52 because you. You bought sappers to kick uh, expansions. Yeah, food in sappers. Yeah, I'm streaming full screen. I'm, I'm not using OBS. Apparently, you cannot do that with OBS, but. I'm not using OBS. Well, yeah, and I'm poor because Nebu one red food rush me. Yeah, it was more like 80 food, but... <laughs> more 50 food fight. Once uh, Dark Ranger will get level 6, it's going to be very annoying for, for Yane to defend, because uh, destroyers are going to be... Uh, Charmed and uh, and DK is going to be s silenced and uh, it's going to be a uh, pain in the ass to fight. Nice item, Legion Doom Um on uh, on Zark Ranger there. Panda has a uh, staff of teleportation, so he can be staffed back home, get more mana and. Uh, and elf and then stuff back in the fight. That's how you do it when you're a pro knight of player in free fall. So first harassment from uh, from Lost uh, against Yane. I don't know why he didn't do it before. Because uh Ward and Panda is so good to harass and death.
Well, you put it on the Dark Rangers, the Legion Doom Home. So Nebu is hiding there, thinking he can rebuild. And more sappers. Ah, Yen is a terrorist. Well, uh, probably it's better to put the Legion of on the Warden, right? If you sometimes send her on harassment mission, if she's even faster. So I guess it's better on the Warden. Not sure what uh, Nebu is doing in uh, in last main. I think he should stop being ridiculous and leave, or maybe just giving up ex experience to. Yep, and just feeding lost because he's upset. And one more expansion done with sappers. So gold wise Nebu is twenty one thousand against twenty nine. So eight thousand difference. And Nebu zeros are down. And I believe he's going to leave, maybe, I hope. We are talking about giving uh, Nebu a penalty, so apparently this is a FML game, official game. Yeah, Nebu was the kind of player that you were always thinking about giving a penalty to, because always uh, playing against sportsmanship and uh, trying to find loophole into the regulations. We still have those sort of players nowadays, they have other names. Typical solo player sapper obsession. Yeah, but it's doing good because he on, on the same amount of mine or even less mines. Yeah, because Nebu took no expansion on his side, so Lost had more mines, but has eight thousand less gold than Yain with uh with less mine, yeah. So it's a smart move from Yain. He's not that that dumb then. He's a pretty intelligent guy, even though it's two thousand eight. You're just sad, go back to hacking. <laughs> okay. Yeah, red red maybe uh put on XX then. So it's a very hard skilled game except for Nebu. I don't know what he should do uh last at this point to to stop this uh, terrorism from Yain, I think the only solution is to make 100 food and start the and start the 1v1. Because the longer it goes like that, uh, the richer gets uh, Yain in comparison to to Lost. So I think Lost to stop his uh, 50 food uh, the 50 food fun, he should try now to to go and uh, and make real fights. So you see they both have w one destroyer to, to devour magic and one Dryad to dispel. He's going to get the statue as this. So is one of them breaking 41 food and 36 now, still not breaking. So fate is now be getting more more gold, 6,000 gold. I'm going to f to go 8 speed a little bit to see not that it's not fun but it's kinda it's a repetition of I RS you, you RS me, ITP. Uh we can see better things. So another harassment there, T P going to try and see when we start to do something else.
Yeah, I'm so bad with this 8 speed uh, replay move. Okay, I think uh, we went like nearly 10 minutes ahead. Yeah, so Red is uh, still chasing Nebu. Try to rebuild next to Yane. Uh, Mm, nice stuff on the warden, but is he going to be able to save the all the leash at the potion? And he can coil it, cool. Yeah, now it's 2v1, uh, 2v3, so better TP out. Okay. None of them are breaking still. 42 against 44. Little faster. Lost versus Yen is going to be epic, yeah, but takes a long time to be epic. I want to to go up until, if you don't mind, uh, up until they make an army. Because now we are 38 minutes into the game, still no army, 40,000 gold. <laughs> yeah, lost, lost combo is really the best for Hero Arena, uh, for Night Elf. Three is the best, seriously. Uh, someone has to try it. But it's it's, it's very strong against human as well, and against any race actually. So Dark Ranger level five now. So yes, hero advantage five three three for Yane and five five. Uh, five, five, four for lost. So, lost somehow has a big hero advantage. I'm not sure what he killed exactly to get it, but uh, he has it. More sappers from uh, from Yain. Yes, lost is making an army. Someone has to warn Yain. Lost is making an army. Yeah, 40k against uh, 30k, so 10k advantage for Yane. Uh, so the army of Lost is always super well thought, uh, always mixing stuff. Li now he's going Dryads, he pose in Mountain Giants. It's going to be epic fight, I hope, unless it turned to be a ridiculous fight. And let's not forget about Red, he has uh, been left alone for nearly 18 minutes now I would say so he's 50 foot so he has 25,000 gold so 25,000 30,000 so he's not that behind uh, and 34,000 uh, since I just told Yain uh, I just told Yain uh, Lost was making an army so he's making one as well I remember running around killing uh, Expo with Sappers for 30 minutes, but I don't remember the end. Yeah, Red is going to be able to pretend to be broke uh, while he, he did a good job catching up in gold. So free dry out there, uh, which purpose was probably to get the Sappers before they get to the... to the trees. I'm not sure. I see him uh, in the last game I shortcasted that you can find on YouTube against three bats. I saw him uh, splitting his army uh, to fight uh, the tank harassment. He was a. Uh oh, nice! You see that, Yane? Number one fan of knife. Killing uh, the Death Knight in one blow. And you're gonna see this warden. How kick ass it is! And uh, a couple of gargs made by uh, by Yane. Yeah, so he was putting his army to defend against uh, tank harassment. He had a uh, panda staffing and staff tipping everywhere, and he had uh, mountain giants chasing the tanks, and that was nice. 
so now the big fight is coming up and I've actually read is yeah, finishing his last expansion so probably he's going to make an army as well 30,000 gold yeah a couple of guys that was uh, irony so 100 foot of gargs with uh, three statues that uh, is going to change into destroyers against against he has uh, how much food he has uh, lost 100 foot lost of uh, mix of dryads bears well one bear for all um, mountain giants hippogriff chimeras you see it's way more mixed than uh, the regular Renault uh, two units army it's it's more as a better combination of things to to make it more more deadly putting the hippo in the back to to surprise gain but uh, I'm not sure he's going to be able to to beat Yain who was a pure Garg army Yeah, that, yes, he has 90, 90 foot, but uh, those statues are going to be destroyers soon and make uh, men 100. That's why I said he was going 100. Now he has 100 with the, with the Garks. Uh, pff, the statues being uh, destroyers. So, he has a, he has a scroll of uh, Raw, I don't know if you say that. And uh, he's, he has been silenced uh, silence already. He has a lot of gargs. I, I'm not sure he can uh, he can beat that uh, orphan lost. Brief of fire, both in ace, and battle begin. So nice crawling from uh, from Yain. Uh, oh, that's a lot of gargs against not not enough uh, anti hair probably from. Uh, from lost, he kills the leash anyway, but he, he has to retreat because he, he had only like eight hippo, hippo, hippo and uh, his mix was well fought, maybe, but maybe not. Yeah, so he kills the leash, but Yen's army was. Uh, oh, it, oh, the leash had an egg, so he did not even lose uh, the leash. Yeah, so first round for Yen, uh, I, I believe now. He is going to change his army to a pure uh, hippo army. Yes, he has only three hippos now. So Yain should push now. He should uh, hijack uh, uh, Lost uh, before he gets he gets his army. But he has only three ancient of wind or four ancient of wind. Yeah, you had an ink. Yeah, Yen is proud because uh, I'm only streaming game is doing well so far. <laughs> <sighs> I really want to to press kick on uh, on old Nebu, but it's a replay. I cannot do that. Yeah, so no boots on the Dreadlord, which is super slow. Maybe nice buying some. No scrolls and scrolls. Scrolls are important too. So he went to kill this expansion, but he never made it back. He was moving trees there, so another tree is trying to retrieve the trees. Is he going to TP on the tree? No, he doesn't have his full army yet. Nang is saying that the panda should have more hit points. He's catching a few destroyers that. Uh, but uh, Yen forget, and now it's a better army. One mountain giants, two dryads, uh, one uh, talon, and uh, the rest of hippos and chimeras. Still out, out food on, uh, outnumbered in, in the gags against hippo war. But let's see if uh, Penda, Penda Warden can uh, compensate for that. So only, oh, he's, he's using TP. Yeah, I don't, I don't think he could win that side. So just using TP was uh, probably better. 
But since it's 100 food, unless he kills some units to, to make more hippos, he's going to... Uh, he made room for some hippos. Maybe he detonate some, some units. Nice, oh, got it's a uh, shade from red. So, why nobody's killing Nebu, please? So Nebu is down. Ah, uh, Yen, Yen and Lost are running into each other. Uh, <coughs> Better use of scrolls. Uh, the hippos are just running around, being chased. Uh, I'm not sure what Lost is doing on this fight. Uh, another loss. Another loss uh, of battle from Lost. He actually killed nothing. Uh, was hippo hippo grief just <coughs> running around, being chased? Yeah, again lost only one guard. So that's where uh, Yen started with a huge old disadvantage, but uh, whatever Lost is doing, I'm not sure. Uh, you really need to go pure hippos uh, on that and g getting more scrolls. He has, he has not even a scroll, uh, one, just one scroll. Hmm. Yeah, lost that like 12 people against 24 gargs, yeah. Oh yeah, red can win, you know. Uh, red is uh, 28,000 gold and at the point is going to be called for help by whoever is losing. So far it's lost. Lost tension is losing at the moment. But if they can start to be a 2v1 against uh, Yane, Yane, uh, my friend, you have a terrible main look at Yen's main uh, you can really snipe this black citadel uh, in 20 seconds and nowhere else to TP uh, no defense only one graveyard so if someone kick his necropolis there his black citadel he cannot make any cards and you can kick the graveyard as well and then and then uh, you TP back and you come back and that's over this is a better main Term of defense, uh, one more necropolis to TP on, uh, production building in the back, uh, uh, some sort of smart way to to align your your ziggurats. Uh, yeah, that's a better main. And lost, of course, has a very 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 nice main. Okay, back to the game. Yeah, your your main is a. Uh, really desperately asking for being uh, torn apart yeah, so as is completely ignored by the other fate is now is taking uh, the expansion between uh, Yane and uh, and lost and lost went for checking that and he decided not to engage red because he realizes that he's losing and he's going to need uh, reds on his side little more little more he paused but i don't know why he made a second mountain giant Little more speed until the fight. And Yain. Will Yain engage red? Nope. Well, you ordered enough. I fought Nebu. Yeah, it was uh, 30 minutes ago. So he didn't let him keep the mine, but he didn't kill the Acolyte. So he was more aggressive than uh, Lost, but still did not kill the unit. But it turns like uh, red will be on lost side uh, in not in not so long. 
Okay. I hope this fight is going to turn better for Lost because the last few were a little disappointing. So you see how you can snipe a Necropolis, a Black Citadel, whatever. Brief of fire on it. And now, no more gags for Mr. For Mr. And so yeah, you can just TP, try to save as much as you can. Well, but it's better when you kill a couple of gargs. Still, uh, you kill six gargs. Uh, three gargs. Six foot of gargs. Yeah, such a big weakness in uh, in Yen's uh, in Yen's main. So he's making one necropolis there. I hope he makes a couple of more. Yeah, he's making two now. Maybe I should do that. I should stop buying boots on my heroes and getting more scrolls. Ah, you remember this game. Don't 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 say anymore about the end or whatever. Lost to can took an expansion with mining at one hundred food. And Yen is uh upping his uh Expansion to all of the dead to try to be able to make more gargs. Another fight. This time, Lost is doing better. He has more food, uh, more scrolls. He's trying to regroup his hippo right, uh, hippogriff. Trying to focus the leash. He's still losing, but uh, ah, fan of knife and uh, both. Brief of fire is finally doing something useful so he is using his TP but he doesn't want to lose his camera then his hippo were a little low um, whereas I lost all the hippo he's going dryads and hippo he's mixing dr with dryads not sure why so he had lost more go uh, more food this time, but still ahead. A lot like 20 food. It's 100 food. Where is his army? There. So red has 100 food, he doesn't need to be 50 since... There's no more gold mine for him to get, but... Uh, Yeah, it's only it five cards, but uh, the idea of the warden is not playing too well this game. I'm, I, w I would like you to watch the other the other game he, he played uh, the la the last uh, game I uh, uploaded on YouTube. It's not only about warden uh, kicking air; it's also about warden blinking, killing heroes, and about warden uh, killing your economy by blinking into your expansion killing everybody and uh, living in a, a second after is nothing you can counter so warden is not just about fighting uh for the gargs Yes, yeah, so far Lost failed in all his attacks. Yeah, and once again he's uh, tried to run his, uh, his hippo, hippogriff around to save them, but... It's not working. DK using the TP because uh, it was close to be killed. But Lost, once again lost the fight and has to retreat yeah, a little disappointed by lost now he's down to 17,000 gold 
And I don't know why he doesn't go pure a poor army with a couple of scrolls. His Dark Ranger is still not level 6 after all those fights. Panda is way away from uh, level 6 after all those fights. While uh, he's already 7 and 6 on, on his heroes and nearly 6 on the leash. Nicely stacked leash with Django of Endurance and a Cat Guard Pipe of Insight for nice auras. Ah, ha, interesting now. Fate is now who could be Proton XX, uh, but I'm not sure. Uh, attacks Yay now. And he has a good army to fight. He has a little too much firms. And since he does not have a uh, nuke, since he, he went Panda, or he has Panda nuke, but he went Panda Pit Lord. So you have to try to focus your rain on fire on your open guards. It's not super easy to do. And he has a too too much too much room to to fight with. Uh, Yain is yet again ending a winner on that fight. Pitlor getting a level five still. Everyone is being stone formed. Level five on the panda as well. Uh, he has to TP. Yen is uh, not losing much food each time he fights. Yeah, he lost like 10 food or also, so like 5 gargs. It's a Yen show so far. And he still has 16,000 gold. He's blue in gold though, uh, little by little. And uh, last is soon to come back. Yep. Last is coming. Without, uh, without the simple rider, so I'm not sure why. So fate, uh, fate uh, is a uh, richer in play on the game now. Twenty thousand gold, lost sixteen, and he ends sixteen as well. So he's uh, okay. He doesn't, he doesn't bring his uh, air units because he just want to try to kick the new uh, the new main. Well, it's not the main, but it's uh, the all of the dead of uh, of Yain. Try to since he cannot win fights, he's going to try to to uh, hurt his economy. And I have to upgrade this again. So as we are turning around each other, Panda is going to be, no, he's retreating, okay. So coming from behind, Glass uh, is going to try to terrorize a little bit uh, Yain, not to let him uh, be over tier 1. No, you're, not, you're not going to be able to do that, you have to TP away, I, I believe. But Taunting, trying to to get the attention on the mountain giants and trying to finish off the the new uh, th the new necropolis of uh, of Yen was close to do it but couldn't do it. Yen so pro. Yeah, Yen has some fun boy at that time. Still has some. Fate is now realized he could not beat Yen with a even an army because uh, Yen is a better micro and Yen has better heroes and Yen has more nuke. 
So I decide to to go with the second option, which is going Necrovagon. So a little acceleration, more sp Alright, uh, Faith is Snob is moving on uh, Yang now, and Lost Ancient is moving on Yang as well, so do you think Yang is going to be able to fight them both? Idea is to try to split them up before uh, they regroup, even though they don't actually attack together. He scared Lost away uh, very well, because now there is uh, Faith is Snob coming. I wonder if I will rage. Well, I don't think so. Since Lost went away, you just have one one guy to fight. So, AMS frenzy. Uh, he needs to try to protect his uh, his necros, uh, focusing the room since it's an easy kill. Using stone form to protect from uh, all of terror and uh, and breath of fire. He's killing. Uh, he's yeah. It's easy to kill those necromancer when uh, you have a Garg army, even though he's not really focusing them. I don't know if Rain of Fire is eating stone from gargoyles. I don't think so. Yeah, he killed a couple of gargoyles. Yeah, Yen is not doing as good as usually. Panda is going down. Yeah, he has to TP. He lost, he lost some units this time. 20 food. Yeah, more than, yeah, 20 food. He lost a pretty much 20 food. And uh, against 37 for his opponent. Could have been worse. Yes, it was okay for, for red. He does not really need to, to win every fight since uh, as long as he Rotian each time he comes. And Lost has level 6 on the Dark Ranger now. So, little speed on the game until the next assault on uh, Yen's Fortress occurs. Um, Let's not forget that Lost is mining there. That's why he manages to go back to 17,000. While now Yen has 9,000. And 17,000 for Red as well. So if he's starting to fight 9,000 against 34,000, it's going to be uh, impossible for Yen. Now. Yen has a shade on Lost, and Lost is not really scouting for shades at all. He should try to. Yeah, they may go to v one against you until you die. Because each time they come, you don't look like you're losing anything. And when it's like that, uh, they, s they tend to insist until they finally break you down. You fall for winning all the fight. Now he has uh, ma many, many fins. It usually doesn't work. And last is um, 80 foot because he's still mining. He's making trees of life next to next to Yen's main to mass TP on him. But Yen saw, saw it with a shade, trying to uh, surprise uh, Lost there. And I don't know why Lost went out with uh, with chimeras like that. 
And another attack. He used uh, Red is using his ultimate to, to kick some building. It's uh What is a smart thing to do? So new Necrovagon attack. Nice dispel. He should bring his fins uh, next to the skellies. Uh, so whenever uh, destroyers are coming, you just uh, you just get uh, get him because if you send the skates in front like that, destroyers will just eat and run and pick them up and giving a lot of experience to the your opponent heroes. That's gonna be hard for for him to fight that he needs to get a good position on the on the necromancer with uh, with, with his gargoyles and he needs to do a good hit and run with his uh, destroyers but if, he's if he keeps retreating like that the uh, problem is he's going to lose all his building so here you go uh, he's trying to get the wagons He has Inferno, which works so well against Fins. He stone formed everything. Very smart. And now the guys are back. And that's going to be a slaughter for, for Red. Yeah, very smart move. Everybody is uh, applauding yeah, in insane, insane. He killed 42 food of uh, of him just bringing the uh, he brought his guard into the fight to kick the wagon so there is no more skullies coming up. Then uh, stone form everything so he couldn't be web and focused. Fought with heroes. Heroes they don't fear much fiends and uh, especially when you have an inferno with you and then uh, put the gargs back in the fight uh, and demolish your opponent so very well played and right away he goes on uh, an attack lost so lost is not getting this goal it's very important that lost is not getting more gold and now Lost is trying to get this all of the dead down. Impossible to TP, he has to TP on the other one. Yes, yeah, so uh, Yen is going to have to be careful because... Yeah, yeah actually he was not careful. Always have an acolyte. Never, never kill them all. Always have uh, a couple of acolytes, even though you're not mining, even though you're not building. Because then you could get into a situation that you get 100 food out of 70, and you will never be able to to make acolytes anymore. Uh, up until he loses the fight, but uh, it's very easy to kick those four Ziggurats, then you are whatever 80 full out of 20, and then you lose all your building, and you cannot rebuild even though you have gold. So now he's down to one Necropolis, which could very well uh, be kicked uh, any time by uh, Lost. Yeah, you lost half your base, but your base is uh, very hard to defend. It's not very, very well built. And always, always keep an acolyte. I saw so many players doing so well, but then b getting food blocked and uh, revealed, and uh, even with gold, could not rebuild. 
Oh, that's the end of Yen now, I think. Yeah, Lost obviously is not coming to fight. You know, he knows Yen is too strong in fight, so he's just go going to come, kick buildings, TP, come kick buildings, TP uh, until Yen is out of uh, of building. And now, Red is coming again. Yeah, he needs to talk uh, because apparently I don't think Shred is aware of the fact that Lost has been coming and uh, and kicking his building and so on. Yeah, Yen may be angry at the end of the game. So the Inferno Stone on a... Uh, well, not Stone, it's Inferno on the... Oh, nice surround, nice surrounding with Stone form on the Decay. Using a, making a wall of Gargoyles. He's eight eight nine now on his heroes. Kicking all the wagons. Ah, this is a, a qualifier for FML. Yeah, this is a FML qualifier. So the winner qualifies for FML. It's not going to be Yang now. Yeah, Fetis Dom reaches level 6 on his pit load, so nice defense, but now Yang has only 64 food and like six buildings and uh, you have uh, Lost coming back. He loses a couple of cameras each time but nice use of the Avatar of Vengeance of the, of the graveyard. <laughs> no wonder I had a bad feeling about this game. Yep. Got to do what you got to do. Yep. Not a very... Honorous way to win for, for loss, but I think loss has been upset by uh, Yen harassment with uh, Sappers before. Uh, he's obviously confident to kill Red afterwards. Uh, he's way better than Red, so there's no reason for him to stop eating Yen at all. For Red, uh, there will be some reason to to stop. Ten thousand for Red. Nine for Lost. And Yen has 5,000, but uh, do you see as I foresaw? Did not have any, any acolytes, so couldn't rebuild. So now, Lost is smart enough not to uh, bring everything to the, to the fight, just bringing uh, what's needed to kick buildings. And now he could. Uh, 
probably do the supper harassment on Yain. Always down to free building. Still not talking from Yen. He must be uh, raging inside. And he's engaging uh, lost tension on his uh, expansion. Yeah, 64 foot against. Uh, I'm not sure how much from, uh, I would say, 80 foot from, uh, from lost. No, oh, 100. So Lost is fighting this because he wants to win a fight against Yain, maybe. <laughs> yeah, he's winning this fight with a 30 foot advantage. And his tree was kicking ass there. Very strong play from Yain. He did really well in fights. But he he lacked some uh, some little chat to uh make Red aware of his situation and make Red think about what he was planning to do against uh, Lost whenever he will be down. Defeated. So what is going? What's Yen is going to say? He's not saying anything. Everyone is saying awesome, awesome, ah, awesome. Is that the win? He's not raging. T taking it well. Yeah, he's not. He's not upset. Yeah, very nice. Uh, he won all the fights. It's uh, Rob Stark of uh, this game. Can't maybe send a prayer as a chat has thought he wasn't kidding. Well, he could have tried. So now the, the game is not going to be long. Uh, just a uh, few minutes left. So let's see who is going to win between. Fate is now been uh Okay, Yen says that he did not uh, try to manip red because uh, at start uh, red was saying let's free free one Yen so he was joking but also pretty much implying that Yen was so strong everyone should attack him until he dies so that's why he thought it was not to reason with him. Could have tried, doesn't hurt to try. So this uh, Necro Vagon army are very weak uh, when they are walking around, because if you run into uh, an idle army uh, when you're on the run like that, uh, it's very dangerous. So that's why he's sending a, a shade to scout what's happening in front of in front of him. Lost has many, many, many chimeras. Is going to be faster on uh, on fate main before than before than uh, fate is going to be in a uh, lost main. I think usually when you're night elf, it's very hard to fight a uh, necrovagon army, but you usually just have to uh, not defend. You just go to the main of the undead and you kick ev every building with chimeras to force him to TP to defend. And when he is not in in a good position after a TP, you you just kick everything out. A well positioned uh, Necro Vagon army is very hard to fight. But he's losing time. Uh, when he's going on the expo, you can buy sappers or whatever uh, to do that. We saw it before. And now uh, yes. Is is sniping the uh, the black citadels? First TP missed and second TP. 
Missed as well. <laughs> but it was silly from red. Not a chance. Lol. Yeah. Why are you so stupid that you want to TP on the... Uh, I'm sorry about my language, but why do you want to TP on the necropolis which is being hit? And is, is, is this necropolis is going down. Just TP on the other one. And another dude uh, with 100 foot out of 10. And was no acolyte, so same same mistake as Yain. Uh, so now obviously Red is going to go down. So even though Lost played bad uh, overall, uh, he, still, he still outsmarted everybody in the end. See, this is the kind of positioning that is it's bad for, for Night Elf when we fight a, a Necromancer army. So of course it's going to go well for him since now Red has no more. Nothing to rebuild. Since he has only uh, one necro police left, he will need uh, to go to go down to five food, so just to one arrow to be able to rebuild something. So it's not going to happen. Nice drain of life. Trying to, yeah, nice silence. He, he was trying to get this uh, Dark Ranger down, taunt on the uh, earth. Yeah, he, he did a good fight, uh, fate on, on, on this one, but he did a dumb move uh, with missing his TP like that and going to attack the expansion instead of the main. Oh, everyone is red now. One buff and you kill three heroes, maybe. Uh, you kill one. Oh, yeah. It would have... Yeah. It would have been fun to, to get a big breath of fire and getting three heroes down. Yeah, one breath. Yeah, it would have been good. Ah. Yeah, he's killing the wagons and everything. Oh, the warden. Catch up on the... <laughs> on the death knight. <laughs> yeah, see the power of uh, of the world in there. Such a pest. I double click the first TP, it didn't aim it. Yeah, he's commenting. See, it's like the guy, this guy's comment on what I'm saying, yeah. It's bad TP is talking about how he just click 7-7 seven, seven or whatever instead of aiming the TP to the right necropolis. Well, of course it's bad, but... Uh, oh, he had an acolyte. I, f I, s I said he did not. He had an acolyte. GG, so yeah, an MVP, but uh, yeah, not not qualifying. I pretty I presume he qualified after. I uh, lost uh one second, fate is now third and old Nebu of course last. Hero kills Yen did not kill any hero actually all game long. Uh but in units he he killed four hundred and seven units. Oh, he killed a lot of uh, skellies, but uh, still. All right, that's it. So this was a uh, FML qualifier from 2008. I'm not sure, maybe season eight, season seven, season eight, whatever. So thank you for listening to me tonight. Uh, oh, I have a new follower, Mani Tejera. So thank you, Mani, to follow me on Twitch. Alright, and uh, I'll be back probably tomorrow with uh, some live games 
from the bots live uh, if you want to know who is playing at the moment yeah not many not many non players as you can see that we get more and more players from Wafri Arena now oh Persuade is playing still playing on Harvest it was it's a long game And Paul Kwape is playing as well on some rock curve. And uh, that's about all the people. Uh, I am Faber is playing on Typhoon. This guy is funny. Yep, that's it. It's it's quiet. It's a night. That's always the case. Fun watching how much better I used to be at micro. Yeah, thank you for watching and. Uh, I was happy to to solve those games. One game on Blood Venom Falls, which was okay, and then uh, we watched uh, two games from Yain uh, playing. Yeah, it was good to see you play Yain, but uh, I'm a little disappointed that uh, we saw you only against Undead and uh, Undead and Night Elf. And Kva, Kva, Kva is, uh, someone has subscribed to my. Uh, YouTube channel, so please do that if you didn't do it yet. Uh, Kvaga of Chinikov, thank you. Yeah, I was disappointed you, you were facing only Night Elf and Undead, and I know it's your your strong against both races. I would have would have liked to see you with your Dreadlords again. Uh, again, Orcs or or humans, uh, but uh, that's okay. Probably next time. All right, so good night. And see you tomorrow, maybe.